sea change that is going on out there. You are trying to lead an insurgent party to replace yeah. the main parties. Therefore, you're an important figure in this. I think we are going to have to move yeah. to an insurance-based system of health care. I would feel more comfortable. My money would return value if I was able to do that through the marketplace of an insurance company than just trusting giving us £100 billion a year to central government. Do you still hold that? If, I was, if I was encouraged to opt out of the system to relieve the burden of national health service, I would do so gleefully. Do you want to discuss these European elections or not? Yes, I certainly do. Go, go on, on then. I, I, go on then. Let's try. Do you still believe that global uh, worrying about global warming is the stupidest thing in human history? I believe that if we decide in this country to tax ourselves to the hilt, to put hundreds of thousands of people out of work in manufacturing industries, given that we produce less than 2% of global CO2, that isn't terribly intelligent. But as I say, here we are with one of the biggest changes in politics that's ever occurred, okay. and you're not even interested. Do you still What's want, wrong with the BBC? Do you still want to what roll, is wrong with the BBC? Do you still want to roll back gun controls and reintroduce handguns throughout this country? This sums it up. Do you know, I've been going around the country speaking at pack rallies every night, and do you know who's not there? The BBC. And from this line of questioning now, I can see why. Do you still, you're, not, you're just not interested. Do you still feel uncomfortable you are with foreign just languages not being spoken on? Trade. Let's talk about democracy. Let's talk about trust. Let's talk about competence in politics. This is ludicrous. Do you still feel that people with HIV shouldn't be allowed into this country? Do I think the National Health Service is there for British people? Yes, I absolutely do. So you, you still do? Um, do you this is absolutely ludicrous. I've never in my life seen a more ridiculous interview than this. You are not prepared to talk about what is going on in this country today. You're in denial. The BBC is in denial. The Tory and Labour parties are in denial. I think you're all in for a bigger surprise when we don't see what you can it. even imagine. We have talked about it. Do you still admire Vladimir Putin? No. I've never admired Vladimir Putin. You, well, you asked, I said I wouldn't like to ask which stuff, current you know, world leader you most admired. You told GQ magazine, as an operator, but not as a human being, yes. I would say well, Putin. The way so he played the whole so Syria thing. Not as a human being. So I don't, like him as a, I don't like him as a human being. What is your question? What is the relevance of this? I'm, I'm, trying, I'm, I'm, trying, to, I'm trying to work out who you are, where the Brexit I'm, party, which wants to I, destroy the party system, asked, is You going. haven't asked about a single other member of the Brexit party. You haven't